Hey everybody, Peter from Giordano's here, and today I'm going to go over seven tips on how to attract hummingbirds to your garden. Here on Long Island, the only hummingbird we get is the ruby-throated hummingbird. Here's a picture of the male on the left and the female on the right. The first tip is that hummingbirds are more attracted to certain colors than others. Specifically, hummingbirds love the colors red, orange, and purple, especially vibrant forms of these colors. The second tip is to incorporate plants that attract the type of hummingbird, this type of hummingbird. You know, they love tubular plants like this trumpet honeysuckle. They also love cardinal flower, columbine, bee balm, and frankly, any nectar producing plant. If your plant attracts bees or butterflies, it can attract hummingbirds. The third tip is to use a hummingbird feeder. These birds are not fussy at all, so go with a feeder that is easy to fill and works with your budget. Use a 1 to 4 ratio of sugar to water, for example, 1 cup sugar per 4 cups water, to use in the feeder. Dyes are not needed in the sugar solution. The fourth tip is to create a safe environment for the hummingbird. Hummingbirds are fairly defenseless and are cautious around predators, including feral cats, owls, hawks, and even smaller birds, such as orioles, ravens, and grackles. If these predators roam your property, you may have difficulty attracting hummingbirds. Tip five is to learn how to listen for the ruby-throated hummingbird. These guys are super quick and may be difficult to catch a glimpse of, of them initially, so you may hear them before you see them. This is what they sound like. Tip six is that multiple feeders may be necessary. Males are particularly territorial, and if you are able to attract multiple hummingbirds, they will fight over territory. You can watch that play out, or you can add a second feeder at the other end of your property. It's your choice. Finally, tip seven is that hummingbirds do not feed at night. It is almost impossible to see a hummingbird at dusk or later. They feed in the mornings and afternoons, so if you're trying to bird watch, time your schedule accordingly.